Happy Wednesday evening. How is everybody? Okay, so <laughs> I made soup for dinner tonight. What kind of soup? Well, I actually I posted it, so that's really kind of a loaded question, but guess what kind of soup I made for dinner tonight? Let me show you. Okay. Ta -da -da -da. Creamy cheddar broccoli soup before I spill it all over my counter, right? Creamy cheddar broccoli soup. Who loves the keto-friendly creamy cheddar broccoli soup? I know that this is late, but I just got home right now and I had to share it with you guys, like always. So who loves creamy cheddar broccoli soup? Raise your hand, raise your hand. I do, I love it. Hey Jimmy, what's going on? How's Arizona? How's Arizona? Scott, what's happening? What's going on you guys? How is everybody? What did you guys have for dinner tonight? Teresa, what'd you eat for dinner tonight? What's happening? What's going on? Tell me everything. Hey Greg, how are you? What did you make for dinner tonight? How's it going out there in Algonquin? What's new? Tell me everything. I hope everyone's holidays were fabulous. And, oh my God, before I forget, tonight's the last night to order the reboot, the keto reboot. In case you wanna do it with me, it's on January 19th. Tonight's the last, or tonight is the last night to order the keto reboot. Okay, this live is not about the keto reboot, but it just popped into my head right now for something. Hey Chester, how are you? Hi Brett, what's going on? If you want to order the reboot, tonight's the night to order. Otherwise, no mas, my friend, till February. Ah, February. Can you believe I just said February? Happy 2020. Who is having the best time ever in nowhere near as awesome? You are so sweet, Jimmy, but I'm thinking that Arizona weather is probably way more fabulous than me right now. I'm just saying. Scott Payne, you can come on over to my house. You know exactly where I live. And to be honest, I was thinking about you painting my bedroom today. <laughs> I don't know why. I was sitting in the bedroom and I was thinking, you know that color we put in Gia's room was really pretty fabulous? I think I want my room that color too. I don't know, Scott, I think you gotta come pay a visit over here and paint my room. I'm just saying. Jimmy, while Scott's painting my room, I'm gonna come to Arizona and hang out with you because I think the weather is way nicer there than it is here. Because today it's so chilly here. That's all I'm saying. Okay. For around the corner, yes, I know. Well, Brett, if you lived around the corner, you could come on over too. I can't tell you everything more stuff. So <laughs> Teresa, you're so funny. <laughs> I hope you're having a fabulous time, whatever your X-ratedness is. I hope it's fabulousness all everywhere. Okay, so here's the deal. Cheddar broccoli soup. Here we go. I made this, well, I made the decision to make this soup instead of a couple other different soups because a girlfriend of mine is not feeling well and this is her favorite soup. So I aim to please and I have extra. So if there's anybody, Lisa, you live right down the street. Anybody wants some extra, some extra, some extra cheddar broccoli soup, you're welcome to step over and have a cup. Anytime, gorgeous girlies. Um, Carol, you should have taken some tonight before you left. What do you want? You can have some, yeah, help yourself. It's in the pot right there. See, my daughter's gonna help herself too. I got customers everywhere. Except for, the, she's like a free customer, but that's okay. I love her, she's really cute. Okay, okay, focus, and Cheddar, keto, keto, cheddar, broccoli, soup. Who wants some? Who wants to know how I made it, too? This recipe, like all of my recipes, is so very simple. Truly, everything I do is simple. I keep saying that I've got six kids, right? I have to make life easy for myself, and I have to make it as nutritious as possible while I'm making it as easy for myself as I can, because seriously, I made the soup, and then I've been running around. Do you deliver to Bull Scott, you know where I live. You come over here. I love Bull Valley. If I had a helicopter like you, Scott, Scott drives around in a helicopter, so don't let him fool you guys. If I, he takes his helicopter out to lunch. Me, I'm making lunch. I'm cleaning up after lunch. I haven't even had lunch yet today. Who am I kidding? I haven't even eaten. Will you message me tonight? Yes. Teresa, I, yes, I'm so sorry. I will message you tonight, yes, for sure. So, Scott, you fly your helicopter over here and I will give your pilot a, a cup of soup. Actually, I'll give him like four cups of soup for you and your beautiful wife. How about that? Cheddar broccoli for everybody. Okay, so moving right along. Yeah, hello. oh, no, I'm sorry. It's not a helicopter. <laughs> you know what, Scott, you're totally right. It's an airplane, it's not a helicopter. It's an airplane. Okay, you're totally right. I don't even know why I said helicopter. I don't even know why. Probably because you were just in Hawaii and I was thinking helicopter for some reason. You have an airplane. <laughs> That's 
way more fabulous than a helicopter, right? A helicopter is like what those people have, right? I have a vehicle. I have like a little car, right? <laughs> it's amazing how you do it. You're, Jimmy, I'm not amazing. I am just like one foot in front of the other. Honest to God. Okay, truly, it's ketones. Let's be real. I don't do drugs. I don't drink alcohol. I don't smoke pot, even though it's like totally legal everywhere now, right? No, I don't do anything. I just drink ketones. And that's what keeps me going every single day, which is why everybody should be doing the reboot with me, by the way. Everybody should be doing the reboot with me because this is how you get when you're on the reboot. You get lots and lots of energy, right? Doesn't everyone want to be talking like me a mile a minute at 10 p.m. at night, right? I think you do, just a little bit, just a tiny bit. Or I just need this energy in order to handle all of my children because they're here, there, and everywhere. Nobody listens to me. So I gotta get control in some way, shape, or form. I'm just saying. Okay, let's get to the cheddar broccoli soup, why don't we? So, keto cheddar broccoli soup. I don't know if it looks delicious through the phone, but it's really, really yummy, I promise you that. I'm more fabulous than an airplane. You're so sweet, Scott, thank you, but your airplane's pretty fabulous too. So, cheddar, keto cheddar broccoli soup, and this is how we make it. Okay, so, you begin with broccoli. Regular broccoli, regular broccoli, chop it up, put it in your pan. Do you see that big pan? Can you guys see this big pan that I've got back there, okay? Put it in the pan. You put it in the pan and you want to submerse it in bone broth, okay? So I submersed it in chicken bone broth today. So chop up broccoli, fresh broccoli, put it in the pan, pour some chicken bone broth over it, simmer it, simmer it until it's tender. Now, the next step you do not have to do, I chose to do it. So I scooped it out and I put it into a blender and I blended it up so that it was like not, it wasn't big chunks of broccoli, it's like pureed, right? Like super creamy, just pureed. You do not have to do that. If you like chunks of broccoli, omit that part completely and just move on to the next. So broccoli, bone broth, let it simmer. Then you pour some heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream, I got this from, or I got this from uh, Walmart. Heavy whipping cream, but this is not organic. Go buy the organic if you can afford it. Whatever floats your boat, whatever makes you happy. So there you go. I put some uh, heavy whipping cream and then shredded a block of cheddar cheese. So here is the remainder in this little bag. But I always buy blocks of cheese because I keep saying this all the time. The block of cheese is better than pre-shredded because the pre-shredded cheese has a coating on it. The coating is like a potato starchy coating to keep the little bits of cheese from sticking to each other. You don't want that when you're on keto. You don't even want that in general in life. You don't want the potato starch co coating. You don't need it, so get a grater, shred your own cheese. So I have a block of, here's the remainder, but it was a big block, right? So literally, this is how easy it is. Broccoli, bone broth, until the broccoli gets nice and tender. You can put it in a blender at that point. You ordered a pizza, Greg, no pizza. Cheddar broccoli soup tonight, right? Cheddar broccoli soup. Cheddar broccoli tomorrow. You'll have my leftovers, okay? I got you. So, broccoli, bone broth. At that point, you can add your heavy whipping cream or you can take it and you can put it into a blender or a Cuisinart or whatever, blend it up, put it back into the pot, and then at that point, you add your heavy whipping cream, heavy whipping cream, you add your shredded, the cheese that you shredded yourself, shredded cheese, stir, 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 add some more cheese, stir, 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 add some more cheese, stir, 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 call it a day. If you want, when you serve it, and this is what it looks like in the end, and believe me, it's so tasty, you can add some Himalayan sea salt and some pepper, so salt and pepper, but Himalayan sea salt is the one I recommend that everybody uses. And then when you go and you serve it to whomever you're serving it to, like me, it's my inmates, you can sprinkle on the top some of this pre-shredded cheese. This is a block, I get it, but I pre-shredded most of it. This is the remainder. And then you put, it's so delicious. Carol, it's so delicious. Gia just came in here and had like her 12th helping. It was that delicious. Super, super delicious. So I suggest everybody makes cheddar broccoli soup for dinner tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday, right? What do you guys think I should make for dinner tomorrow? Hi Mary, how are you gorgeous? Mary, how's the warm weather by you? 
I know it's fabulous. It's cold here in Chicago, so don't come home yet. But when you do come home, come and visit me. Okay, that's it. Cheddar broccoli soup in a nutshell. Who's gonna make it tomorrow? What should I make tomorrow? What are your suggestions? Give me suggestions, people. Everything, tell me. Give me, what do you think I should make? Okay, I think I should either make pesto soup, I should make keto lasagna soup in a bowl, or I should make um, spicy buffalo chicken soup. Which one do you guys think I should make? Super, super simple. Ron, this was super, super simple and it was only like four ingredients, right? Super simple, super nutritious, keto friendly, all the kids. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. All right, you guys, I'm gonna let you go on that note. Have a great night and if anybody's interested in ordering the reboot, now would be the time to order. Tonight is the night, it's the last night. Have the best night ever. Happy Wednesday, see you later.